y'all welcome back to my channel i was told that i should start doing introductions <laughs> and i like to take uh criticism all criticism is welcome so um i am going to introduce myself my name is marquee i go by astro on this channel for astro's closet i have been a reseller for quite a long time i've been reselling on ebay since 2007 and i have been on macari for three years two years poshmark three years and uh i just basically like buying stuff for the low and flipping it i don't know i think some people skydive and stuff and they jump off buildings and stuff for adrenaline rushes shopping gives me an adrenaline rush and i control it because i will get out of control if i don't so that's my intro you guys on this channel i basically show you guys you know uh what i buy on the cheap days and thrifting here in houston i go to family thrift i go to goodwill beans and i just like to show you guys what i get so this video is going to be titled i'm revamping my um somebody is texting me it i'm revamping my macari closet because i'm going to insert a video in here and show you guys that i literally i probably only got like 15 or 20 things up in my macari closet jump on spring early and so i don't think that it's like top priority right now people aren't really seeing the things that they need to uh in order for me to i guess sell them because i put them up back in february so i try to i flip my closets like they do basically you know when they have runway shows and stuff they put their spring collection out that's when i get started on mine but for some people it's too early i understand i'm here in houston and all of those things so without further ado if you like the content on this channel please consider like comment subscribing sharing and um i'm basically going to be showing you guys some of the things i got on the cheap day here which is 25 cent day i go to a houston um on wednesdays they're all over the city but you do have to check because some of the family thrifts here do not participate in the 25 cent 50 cent dollar 75 cent different days so you have to check with them okay so most of these things i'm going to be putting on macari um let me say one more thing macari is like low ball central for me because besides poshmark but macari is like low ball central people want the biggest thing for the smallest amount and the shipping can be a little tricky on macari so i try to make sure everything that i get can fit in a first class envelope or a first class uh, mailer it doesn't weigh any more than 12 or 13 ounces and i can send it out first class so everything that i get i try to make sure that it can be done that way okay this is for me i didn't get this for nobody but me it's just a little faded glory because i wouldn't buy faded glory to resell but it's just a little dress um, a little blue dress little cotton dress so i did that for a quarter that's for myself of course all right so these shirts are by roman and they're a size 34 36 like 4x and plus size and the reason why i picked up these women polos i probably should scoop back i don't have anywhere to scoop back to i don't want to push that off and I don't want to change my lighting. Maybe that helps. <laughs> All right. So these little polo shirts, they were new. And I found like four of them. So I was like, I can do a bulk, you know, like a little bulk sale of these polos and put them together. 4X. I like finding larger sizes because a lot of people don't buy them, don't sell them, so it helps. Here's another one, 4X. This one looks like it's been worn a little bit and the material is a little different. I'll still include it in the bulk and probably do like 4 for 20. The other one is in here somewhere. That might help if I close this. All right. So this is Yadu. Oh. Y-A-D-O. Not familiar with this brand. But it is a medium. 
and I was in the store looking at this. I wish I could fit it. So, it's a little jumpsuit. It's green. It's a one piece. And it zips up in the back. Here's a Harley Davidson top. Harley Davidson pink top with the little crisscross shoulders in the back. Harley Davidson seems to sell pretty well for me. Okay, this is the us versus them long sleeve, three quarter length sleeve. And I'll probably put this on eBay logo shirt. This is an Ann Taylor large double shirt. I like to sell Ann Taylor on thread up though. It actually does well. We have a lot of Ann Taylor shows, sh shows, a lot of Ann Taylor stores here. So it works out uh, when I send things up to thread up. Now, this is a Daskins. Daskins now. Activewear is hot. Activewear is doing really good for me right now. So, this little cute little Activewear top. Now, these are the things I got for Macari. Little tops like this. Little quick little $5 flips. Turn a quarter to five bucks or so. Um, this is American Eagle Outfitters. Extra small racer back with the zipper in the back. I don't know why it's showing up this color on the camera. It's really green. That's not even my watch, and I'm dealing with it. Okay. So, here, no boundaries. I think I bought this for myself. It's just a little tank. Mustard colored little spaghetti strap tank. I'll be putting this on Macari. Uh, let's see. Express 100% silk. It's like an orange color, orange red. The size is a medium. And this is, I, I don't know if this is like, I think it's like an older tag. Probably need to take this off. There we go. I'll be putting this on Macari. So I figured I could just, you know, get all these lightweight shirts because it's easy to ship. And uh, it's, it's like a quick flip for me. Iris Los Angeles. And this is a little sheer crochet brown racerback top pocket in the front. Um, I found a, a Khloe Kardashian shirt. I'm not going to break my nail trying to take that off, though. This is cute. It's floral, and it's trimmed in this black, soft-like material. And it's cropped, so I'm pretty sure it's like a midi shirt. I like that. That's the first time I found um, Khloe Kardashian's line. Now, I did find some... Kendall and Kylie, I found a romper of theirs and I haven't showed it to you guys because I don't even think I showed you guys that haul that I did. This is Beach Royal, extra small, little layered top, racer bag. Quick little shirts to get my Macari closet back to jumping. All right, I think this is silk too. This is uh, BB. I remember pulling it piece by piece. <laughs> I don't know why it's showing up blue. This is 91% silk and 9% spandex. So this is going to look way better on my mannequin probably. It's a wraparound top. So it has like the, uh, 
I really don't like that this looks blue. This is green. What? What's wrong with my camera, you guys? Just put it through here, and I don't know if sequence is in style right now, but I mean, somebody will think it's jazzy. Hopefully, I'll make probably about seven dollars off of that after fees and all that stuff. Some fees will get you. Here's another BB top, size large. So here's the front. Has these gold bars, gold hardware in the front. And the gold hardware on the buttons. And it stretches. It's halter. Um, I don't know if people still wearing halter tops, but we're gonna find out, right? And it zips. It zips. It has an invisible zipper here. I need to wash this because it like had deodorant on it, and it zips all the way down to the bottom. I might have to break this video up because I'm 10 minutes in, you guys. This is wallpaper. And the last three letters of wallpaper is her. So the her is definitely accentuated. This is another racer back. Pink lace front. Embroidered. Lace on the front. Um, this is a papaya. Everybody is still wearing bodysuits. So here's a bodysuit. And it has like the black lace in the front. And I'll be washing these things. But they were clean. Most of the stuff looked like it was washed. When somebody donated it. Now, even though it is like spring, summer is approaching for us in Houston. I still buy fall and winter clothes. This is a vintage J. Crew 100% cotton velour blue jacket. That's the buttons. I can list this in the fall. Well, I can put it up whenever and somebody can buy it. But for fall or, you know, that's why I like eBay. Like, people shop all year round. And I have to remember just because it's really hot here in Houston does not mean it's hot everywhere else. Uh, I have an ideology 100% uh, cotton skirt size 4 and I just like skirts like cotton cotton skirts that feel like this. This is good cotton material. It's good for the spring work wear, a little business. Maybe somebody's attending a brunch or a meeting or something. You can't go wrong with picking up stuff for a quarter like, you know, use your imagination. I don't like these. They put staples in everything and it's it's not good. And Taylor size medium. And this is like a little black top. I see y'all see I can y'all can see through it. Y'all can see how the little holes are. It has a three fourth length sleeve. This is art class. I had never heard of them, but I watched so many thread thread up, so many thrifting videos that I think that somebody said something about this brand before. But look, so it's a, it's a caramel color top, and it has like the little distress sleeves. It's kind of like a sweatshirt, and then it has the long sleeve, long john look under it. So I can list it and I noticed that I have some things that I didn't think was going to sell because like I say, I'm in Houston, right? So I'm thinking like, oh, it's springtime, it's warm here. And people just started buying. Like I literally sold that rabbit fur coat that I had in my Poshmark store and somebody in like Minnesota bought it. So I guess it's still kind of ch chilly in certain places. People are still buying long sleeve stuff. Okay, this shirt says beer, Wheaton. And football so basically beer weed and football so I know somebody's gonna like this it's the extra large and it's a uh, orange and brown y'all know I'm from Cleveland so we'll find out who will buy that all right and I found this when did I pick this up what does this say I didn't know this was on the back. This is a dicky shirt. I just wanted to buy it. 
because it was Dickies and I sell Dickies easily. I don't know. This looks like a race, like a race that happened back in the day. I'm going to have to look that up. I just saw Dickies and was like, grab it. Okay, and this is a cotton tee. It says, I am a nonviolent person until I see a spider. I thought about myself. And what size is this? I said a large, right? I'm a nonviolent person until I see a spider. I know that's right. I found Theory today. That was nice. Well, the other day. This is a medium. And it's just a, it's a vintage theory. I know this is not the newer tag. I don't think so, but white. I'll have to look it up. It might be. I'm not quite sure. I don't really study like a lot. I just know that when you guys mention it on these videos, I know to look for it. Like I don't know all the tags, like if it's new or old. I think I know how to recognize like J. Crew if it's, if the newer tags, you know, and such, but. Some of the tags I can't always keep up with them all. I have an Adidas top, extra small, and I like it. It just says Adidas down the front, and this is like a it's sea green, and the Adidas is cursive. So I like that. All of these, like I said, after after the fee or whatever it is, I want to at least make five bucks off of these. I'm not gonna spend too much time photographing them and. You know, because five bucks, but it's just little bread and butter stuff. Here's a Carhartt shirt for kids. Um, got some camo in it, and it says Carhartt down the front. I know I can sell this. Anything by themselves. Sixteen minutes in, you guys. I found some American Eagle outfitters. Jeggings, skinny. I know low rise is in now and wide leg is in, but some people are still wearing skinny. You guys, please like, comment, subscribe, share. It means a lot for me. This channel is not monetized yet. And I do want to get it there. All this stuff is making me it's dusty. Just a little bit. Alright, this is a top by Islander. And it just has that island aesthetic to it. So, oh, we, if y'all don't look at this. Here's the tag. I ain't even gonna mess it up. Okay. That's the tag. A R E V E. And I'm thinking this is a V ray. I don't know. Size medium. Has a little fur on the front, a little tutu peplum mesh material at the bottom. I'll put it up. I haven't even looked up the comps on it because, like, 25 cent day i'm just throwing stuff in the cart like oh this looks good good material you know and i spent 27 dollars on this haul and i'm not even i'm only on bag two i got about six or seven bags if you guys follow me on tiktok you'll see how much i had i had a whole cart that was so full i couldn't even put the last bag in the cart yep true story Okay, here's another one. I had never seen this. It's called Velvet. And the tag is Velvet. See? It's pretty. Alright, so I had never seen them before. But this is like a little blue. Is this a halter? It's another halter. With, uh, sorry guys. With some stones in the front. And it's blue and white. It's my sorority colors. You know I love blue and white. Uh, I like this shirt. I want to know what size it is. It's by Next Level. Let's see. I don't know if that's a company, but it's just a large. And it says, prove them wrong. 
Yes, prove them wrong. I don't care what it is. People will tell you that you cannot do something. Just hold your ground, be yourself, prove them wrong. All right, so I got these Spring Street shorts. They're high waist, mustard colored shorts. And this button is awesome. And people are doing a lot of vintage wear right now. I've been noticing that. So I'll make sure I'll put that in my wording when I post it. Here's a, here's a Hollister top. I don't know if people were, I said this when I picked it up. I don't think people still wearing Hollister, but so much stuff is coming back. I just don't know. And somebody is calling me. So yeah, I just don't know. Like I'm trying to get it together. Okay, so here's the basis of the top. It's pink. It has this floral in it. That's why I picked it up. And so here's the little back. It's just strappy. I said I'm going to stop this video at 25 minutes. So I like this top. I don't know if I picked this up for myself. I think I did. So I couldn't find a tag on this. This is what I was looking for. So it comes off. I love anything that comes off the shoulder. It has a, a distressing to it. And look at the bottom. Oh, man. I just, I like it. And I remember in the store, I couldn't find a tag to save me. All right. This is M&S Collection. Just a little black and white thin sweater. Very thin, very clean. And it's black and white. It's my favorite colors. Other favorite colors or patterns. This is BCBG Maxaria. Blue, gray, white, black top. Size. I don't know what size this is. It's like a small or a medium. It gotta be like a medium. And here is a dress. I don't know if people are wearing baby fat. But I've been seeing it come back. Like the print on this dress. Is something else. Just the print alone. And it has pockets in the front. So. I don't know. Might keep it for myself. Might sell it. Here's a Michael Kors Petite Medium Crawl Neck Sweater Velour. Some of this stuff I'm just going to put up for the fall or, you know, whatever. I'm going to do a couple more pieces and then I'm going to do a part two of this video because this is a lot of stuff. This is made by Candies. It's an extra large, strappy, lacy, spaghetti strap lace. And it's green, black, white. And it just flows really good for the spring and the summer. And this will be my last piece. I thank y'all for hanging in there with me for 25 minutes. This is a Charter Club Perfectly Soft Pima Cotton. 100% which is really good feeling it has a really good feel to it and it has a little sailboats in it <laughs> so that is that I appreciate y'all this is going to be uh, part one of revamping my Macari closet I should say all my closets but Macari needs the most help so I appreciate y'all for joining me thank you so much for stopping by Asher's Closet here in Houston, Texas. I appreciate y'all. Peace and blessings. Peace, peace, peace.